we're going to look at how we can create an e-portfolio. I'm going to switch now over to uh, the Google site very soon. Meanwhile, you will want to access this website. This is where we will get our template and all the helps. So if you have your computer with you or your mobile devices, go to this website at cel.info slash nie-folio portal. Now, if you have gone to the website, this is what you will see. This is the landing page for the website. This is the site where you will find most of the information you will need. Okay, uh, obviously, the first tab that you will go to is the student teachers one. You can, of course, hop over to tutors and see what we have offered for them. But uh, you will want to stay as much as possible to the students tab. Help site is where you will get all the necessary vi video tutorials and all the various helps. So along the way, if you are creating your site, you come into a situation where you don't know how to do something, uh, go to the help site. Otherwise, you can always email me. Later on, I'll give you my email address. Template is where you will get all your various templates. And ePortfolio Explorations give you some other websites where you can go and explore about what ePortfolio is all about. Okay, so now I'm going to show you the templates. If you click on to the template, under the student teacher's drop-down menu, you should see that there are at least five templates there. The PGDE primary, PGDE PE primary, secondary, PE secondary, and JC. Okay, you're at this page, right? Yes? Okay, just click on any of the templates that belongs to the program that you go to. In this case, I've clicked on to the PGD primary. You should see something like that. Now, the banner here is not in full scale because um, my screen is a little distorted due to the display. Otherwise, you should see the whole entire banner very nicely. And also, the navigation menu at the top uh, spread out properly. Now, how do we start creating our site? If you have already logged into Gmail, it's very simple. Uh, almost immediately you can create the site. Are you able to see that on your top right-hand corner of your screen after you click on the template? Yes? Now, if you see this, on the top right-hand corner over here, instead of a share button, you should see the word use template. Do you see that? Okay, that is the button for you to click to start using the template to create your website. Right, so click on that, and you should be given a series of instructions to create your site. Can you just do that right now and start creating your site? Just like my screen, you should see something like that. Use template. All right, click on the use template. You should be able to start using that. Okay, now one thing to note, you will be required to put in a website name or Google site name. When you create your site, you are strongly encouraged to put PGDE and the year and then underscore your name or just your name right next to it. Okay, I know some of you go, huh, do I really have to do that? Okay, you are strongly and highly encouraged to do that. If you don't want to, I'm not going to force you, but just imagine your lecturer is going to receive like hundreds of invites, right? Then when she or he go into your website, what kind of website they're looking at? And please do not name your website superman.com or uh, <laughs> Wonder Woman or something. Nobody will know who you are, right? So uh, name your website intelligently because you are going to be showing to your principal and your supervisors. Naming convention, PGDE, the year and your name. Okay, if you are curious, um, you can look at the screen. This is the PGDE JC um, site. You notice that the color is slightly different. And for the PE, you will realize that the banner is totally different. We have got this guy kicking a soccer ball around. So you should be able to identify your site very easily. Now, why do we give you different templates? Because you have different courses that you are going through. Your modules are different. They are all listed in your uh, template on the left side navigation menu. So select the right one that is for you, all right? 